understand? Today back in It's already a good start. We have two people who want to play marksman and two plus one is equals three. Yes, I know. I am something of a math wizard myself. But hey, they could just be showing off their win rates or something, right? So for now we're just gonna chill here and let's see what'll happen with our lineup. Meanwhile, the enemies got Martis. I had nightmares the last time I fought him, so this should be really interesting. And what do we have here? Slot 4 showing Kufra. Up oh, there you go. Now we only have to worry about playing, let's see, XP lane, because Slot 5 is looking like she wants to play Fanny. Hey, Melissa, don't worry about the enemies. Worry about our team. We have Fanny in Slot 5, and the enemies have Karina, so Martis is probably gonna go XP lane. Wait. That's gonna be my lane. Oh no, who's uh, gonna be good against Martis? No one right now. So I guess we'll just go with Badang? Because I don't give Badang if the enemy has Martis. Better take Vengeance though, so that we don't die easily. And better take uh, Fighter or um, Assassin. Let's just go with Assassin Emblem. You know how pro fannies always end up in the enemy team? And whenever you get a fanny in your team, they suck. I hope this one's not one of those times. And now that we are in the game, the first thing we're gonna do is not head over to the top lane because we gotta help our Fanny in keeping this hooker away from her blue buff. I'm pretty sure that this is Kufra's job but he's chilling in our red buff, don't know what he's doing there. And it looks like this Franco is not gonna go after Fanny's buff anymore. You're welcome Fanny. I hope me missing a couple of minions and XP and gold is worth it. And this guy is having fun with my tower already and he's already level 2. We better be careful. Hopefully Fanny returns the favor by visiting my lane but I don't think that's gonna happen anytime soon because she's invading the enemy jungle while I have to deal with this Martis just swinging his swords in my face. But that is fine, I know a little cha-cha and we can dance around this Martis. He may be strong but if he does not hit me, then I take zero damage, right? Shut up Martis. It really doesn't seem like we'll get any help from our teammates soon because a teamfight keeps happening in the middle lane. But our teammates not helping us doesn't mean that I won't help them back. Especially when I get an opportunity to massage this Karina without her consent. Now that is what I call a satisfied customer and we've still got a couple of customers here who are actually getting murdered by Odette who got a maniac. What the heck? When did she get so bursty? Who am I kidding? She probably has the biggest set of bursts in the game. You know we're talking about damage, right? Alright, now we're back in the top lane. That team fight really put us ahead of this Martis, I think. I mean, I got 4 assists there and he got 1 death. So maybe it's time to fight back, see if we can take him on, see if we can make a punching bag out of him. But let's not forget, our number 1 job is to clear the minion waves here so that we can eventually get the top lane tower. And here comes Martis slashing Natalius around the battlefield. He looks like someone who just spams his skills, right? It's probably on cooldown right now, let's see if he does that again. As Ricky once said, to win a battle you must know your enemy and right now I definitely know that this guy's skills are on freaking cooldown. Now pause for dramatic effect. Hey Martis, what do you call a four string guitar? Okay, maybe that's too hard. Here's a hint. It's a bass and that's where you went. Haha, <laughs> very funny Shane, that's a good one. It's just that I don't think the enemy Karina liked that one. And it looks like the enemy team didn't get the joke. I mean, it's not really hard to figure out. It's just uh, basic. Am I right? That's where you're going. Basic. I really gotta stop doing this to myself. Okay, why don't we just go back to what we were doing. We were trying to take down this tower and uh, this Martis seemed to be amused. Oh god, why is he just standing there menacingly? What is your plan? I'm actually getting intimidated by this guy, but you know what they say. Everyone has a plan until they get punched a bajillion times. Alright, it looks like he survived that. He's actually getting smarter by the minute. 
Meanwhile, our teammates seem to be resetting the turtle on their own. What are you afraid of? This Karina or this lightning lady? I got a feeling that it's the lightning lady that they're afraid of. She almost took me down. Beam me up, chicken, so that we can keep it at almost. Oh god, I might have won the battles against this Martis, but he definitely won the war by taking down my tower. So I guess he deserves a congratulations, but I only know of one way to congratulate my enemies, and that is to send them back to their base. Now I don't know who these guys are looking for inside that bush. My teammate Natalia is back in the base. Meanwhile, I think we can set up a nice trap here for the enemies because this Karina deserves some love in the form of a million punches. And now that the team fight is over, we can go back to our job which is to save our life and run away from the enemies. Apparently, these two enemies think they can kill and they never did. I mean, they tried really good, really hard, but I was too fast for them. They never stood a chance against my video editor. Don't worry about this Martis Odette, he won't come anywhere near you as long as I'm here, but I'm not there anymore, I'm going somewhere else. Hey Odette, catch. And she really did. I guess we have no choice but to go in because this Kufra set was so fine. That set was so good that it's a set to die for. Thank you, mommy guy. So what if we died? Nothing's gonna stop me from my next goal, which is this mid lane tower, and nobody can stop me except Franco's ultimate, of course. Or maybe death, because I can see that they really want to kill me, especially this Eudora. Oh no, no flame shot, right? No flame shot. Okay, I, I don't think she has one of those long-range executes. Meanwhile, in our top lane, we got a Martis doing an impersonation of Zilong, it looks like. Maybe you should have just played Zilong if you're gonna split push, right? Or you can also play dead. I guess we should push this lane a little bit so that the enemies will be busy trying to defend their top lane while our teammates are taking the Lord. Oh, actually, they're doing it right now. Unfortunately, I'm feeling a little lazy and I don't want to go to the Lord. Besides, we have an appointment with Marcus to rearrange his face. Oh crap, he got flicker. But that is fine, I'm sure we'll get him next time while our teammates are actually getting all the enemies uh, around the Lord area. So I guess they're doing Lord now, huh? Alright, I'll provide them distraction because I'm too lazy to go where the Lord is. And what do we have here? Three distracted enemies who weren't trying to steal the Lord. Good job team, you're welcome by the way. Okay, the Lord took over my job in pushing the top lane, so I guess we have time to join our team here in this little party they're having in the enemy jungle. And everyone knows that you can't have a party without a bowl of punch. But it looks like the enemies couldn't handle the beverage that we brought. See, they're all knocked out after just one sip. It's probably because I put poison in it. And now that all of the enemies are dead, all that's left to do is fist this tower until it's destroyed. And the Lord is here too, taking down their top lane tower. So I guess it's time for the moment we're all been waiting for. Let's make it a little special by using our ultimate. This is probably in my top 10 nicest victory selfie. And look at this minion ignoring my punches. It's, it's probably his nano machines, right? And that's gonna be our Badang gameplay. He's, he's pretty good right now, isn't he? I mean, I'm not even sure if I'm using the right build. This is probably an old one. Let me know if you have the right build and put it in the comment section below for everyone to see. And yeah, I hope you uh, enjoyed this video. Again, my name is Shin Mentagazo. Thank you for watching these videos. Hit like if you enjoyed this Badang gameplay. Check out our other uploads for the many and different heroes we played in the past. Subscribe for more content like this in the future. And as always, please take care of yourself, stay healthy, stay safe, and I will see you guys again in the next video. Peace.